Again. Whatever. Quiet nature. That's gonna ability. You ever look in a mirror and you see yourself? <laughs> Alright, Lily. Uh, shed. What the frick? Okay, what is with so many mons having shed skin? What is with this? Oh my gosh. What is with these mons having shed skin? What the heck? Like,. This has shed skin, and the other one has shed skin. What is with that? What is up, my dude? Starting here, and today is the next episode, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what number of episode this is, um, but. Hope you guys have a great day today. Um, so, uh, I had to scrap a recording before I went on vacation, that week-long vacation that I was talking about in my Mario Maker video. You guys should go watch that. We made progress as the title of the video states, but um, I skipped the record, I scrapped the recording because the only good thing about the episode was the fact that Super Sue was in it and he was only in there for 10 minutes. And my commentary was terrible because I was not prepared to record by myself. And I, it was just a, it was just a bad recording. The only good things about the recording were we defeated the SSN, we defeated the gym, and we got Whirlpool, which is actually that I, I probably should have posted that episode because that we did make a lot of progress in it. But I, I think it would have been a pain to watch. But anyways, I'm gonna start this up, this team recap off with Naruto the Shell Gun, Serious Nature, Oblivious Ability, and the moves Bite, Rage, Focus Energy, and Head Butts. Next up we got Derp, Brave Nature, Color Change Ability, Water Gun, Poison Tail, Bone Rush, and Amnesia. Next up we got one of the MVPs of the team, Mount Vesuvius, Quad Weak to Water, but it's all okay. Impish, ugh, impish Nature. Swarm ability up spoke type moves and a pinch is useless. Magnitude, focus energy, ember, and growl. Next, we have Hedwig, the Noctowl, Jolly Nature, Oblivious Ability once again, and the moves Peck, Reflect, Hypnosis, and Tackle. And we got Rocky up in there with the freaking time lapses of him just working out, you know, like the, the, uh, the training montages, you know what I mean? This man, this man's so good. He's doing helicopter, helicopter kicks on, ugh, kicks on his head. Got him. <laughs> and fish nature, volt absorb ability, and the moves tackle, triple kick, and cut. Yeah, you guys didn't get to see the, the uh, episode where I revealed what his moves and stuff were. And then we got, last but definitely not least, we got Whirlpool, the Umbastar Rock and Water Typing. Didn't need to say it's typing, you guys can already see that on the screen. To be fair, you guys can already see everything on the screen, but Rock and Water, I, whatever. Calm Nature, uh, I guess Rock and Water, you know, it's it's given that these some of these are randomized. Anyways, Lightning Rod Ability, which is actually really good. Sort, wait. Is, is electric neutral though? I don't know. Is it? Is it neutral? I wonder. Um, I'll look into it. Construct, withdraw, bite, and water gun. Right. Let's just make sure everybody's sealed up, and then let's go ahead and keep going. So we came back here to go to Rock Tunnel, and um, get over to Rock Tunnel. Do we have flash? Actually, let's check and see if, see if we have flash. No, we only have cut, it looks like. Yeah, we only have cut. That's a bitch. Oh. Alright, there we go. Sorry, I'm using way too much speed up right now. But anyways, how are you guys doing today? Hope you guys have a great day today. Today, it is August 7th. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys have a great day today. Um, I've been having a pretty relaxing day. Like, I've had some pretty relaxing days. I think tomorrow I'm going back to the lake where my cousin's Super C. You guys should go check out his YouTube channel. He has, it's in the description. No, it's not. Yeah, it, yeah, it is. This is not Mario Maker. But, um, I should probably create an actual description for Mario Maker. 
Anyways, uh, he's at the lake right now. He does, he hasn't posted anything in so long, but I've heard that he's trying to get ready to post something. Uh, okay. Um, but anyways, uh, yeah, so, um, you guys should go check out his channel. He's made some pretty okay videos. <laughs> okay. I need to stop using speed up. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, but anyways, um... I hope you guys have a great day today. I've said that for like the fifth time. Over exaggeration, I know, but still. Anyways. Um, so yeah, so I went to go visit him yesterday. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to go visit him tomorrow. And it was really fun. We swam a little bit. Um, and then we fished a bit. And we went on a golf car ride. And it was really fun. Just staying at, uh, Dreer Island. And, uh, I'm not gonna lie. It's it's pretty great. It was really fun to be there. Um... We made a puzzle, which, like, it was very repetitive. It was a uh, game, South Carolina Gamecocks puzzle. And it was very repetitive because it had the giant symbol in the middle. But on the sides, it had the logos multiple times. So you couldn't really tell. And I accidentally spilled some water on some pieces. So sometimes you couldn't tell if it actually fit. But, yeah. So that's what's going on. Um, with that, uh, Friday, I'm going to high school orientation. Um, high school, I'm not very excited for it because I'm in some honors classes, except for English. And then I've also got art, which I didn't really want, but I'm, but I also want to do art of film. So they put me into art. It's, it's very confusing. But, um, yeah. So, um, yeah. yeah. Um, Pokemon Sword and Shield trailer. That was legit. I loved that trailer because... It introduced regional evolutions. And keep in mind, they're not even revealing all of them. And the first one is already so amazing. I was thinking of another word to say, but, you know, we're PG over here. But, yeah, so that one was so good, though. And his back, the backstory to the Zigzagoon and Linoons in that region are, are like, in the hardcore. Basically, if you guys haven't seen it, uh, the new trailer revealed a lot of stuff, and one of the facts were that, um, Zigzagoon Linoons evolved into a new one, which was, you know, you think maybe me, me really liking this Pokemon, that I would actually, like, actually remember what it, what it, uh, what it's typing, or what its name was. But yeah, so it, they get another evolution, and that evolution is due to the, like, the pollution and the competition that they have in the Kalar region. They were for, they were forced to evolve to survive. Like, that is, wait. Yeah, but that, see, that's the thing, like, they were forced to evolve to survive. Like, I thought that was just so hardcore. It was just like... They were forced to... Um... They were forced to do that. Like, they didn't choose to evolve. They were forced to evolve. Because of the harsh conditions. And I thought that was just really hardcore. But, um... You kidding me? Are you kidding me? Wake up. Yeah, so, um... Uh, wait, I forgot what I was going to say. Wait, never melting guys. Sweet. Uh, let's go heal up. Okay, I am like speed upping all over the freaking place. Oh, uh, wait. Okay, I need to stop. As I speed up. Yeah, so I really liked that. And there were a lot of things that were... I'm gonna put, put my finger right here for a little bit. That like that's just ridiculous. All right, but um, I felt like that was really. I don't know. I don't think there's been something like that in Pokemon before. So I thought that was really cool. I thought it was really cool for them to add that into Pokemon Sword and Shield. But um, they added a a lot of cool Pokemon like uh, freaking um. Uh, the Weezing in that region, um, it was so cool because they added, 
they made it um where the funnels off the top of their heads they were like pure they sent out purifying air which was really cool this was like nintendo solution to pollution solution to pollution dang i see you nintendo i see you nintendo see you with the rhymes out here bro so yeah um i thought the trailer was really cool because it it definitely did add a lot um so i'm very into the uh what am i into about the game i'm into the fact that uh they're bringing back a lot of stuff but then they're they're taking some of the stuff from i don't know the game looks beautiful the content that they're getting out ugh, oh my gosh i'm so disoriented right now the content that they're putting out in the trailers sound amazing for them to be in the game. Like, they sound so fun. Right? Uh, let's get our encounter real quick. But yeah, so... Oh, wait, do we have balls? What's that? What does that evolve into? That evolves into... Wait, I forgot. Do I even have balls? Uh... Catch it as a backup mon. Um, rage? Okay, yeah. There we go. Um, but yeah, so let's name this guy, uh. Uh, sort of want to, like. Sort of want to name of something eating. Related to eating because of his giant mouth. You know what I mean? Like, he's a poison type. Let's call him, uh. Let's call him, uh, Thanksgiving. Or, no, that's terrible. That's stupid. Wait. Let's call him, uh. I can't think of anything, though. Like, I can't think of anything to name this gold. The sculpin. Gulpin more like Gul E pool. Oh Okay. <laughs> this is so dumb. I'm calling this man Goalie Pool. Are you kidding me? If you guys don't know, if you guys are younger viewers and you don't know what goalie pools are, they're basically little pools of water by an ocean caused by like low tide, like the water's there's like this little, it's like this hole of water maybe from me over to that wall or even bigger from any size, really actually. And they will be like a little pool of water, not deep pools of water and stuff, but just in case you didn't know what like, gully pools were. Oh, it's perfect. Uh, pool. I didn't need to speed up to put those O's in. Goalie pool. Oh, it was transferred into the death box. I gotta fix that. Okay, we're good. Let's heal up, and then let's change that. Okay, but, um, so... Uh, the trailer did reveal a lot of things, and I'm very excited for what they've revealed so far. So far. Anyways. Like, um, what they've revealed so far... Is actually getting me really excited for it. Like Gigantamaxing, online Dynamaxing, like those raid battles and stuff. That, those sound fun. Like, um, those sound really fun. Uh, the, the open, the open world, the open world parts, like the parts where you can just find a bunch of Pokemon from different regions that were put into the game, obviously excluding the Pokemon from other generations. Um, you're probably thinking right now, hey, Star D, why are you going all the way back? There's a Pokemon Center over there. I'm buying more balls because we're about to go into Rock Tunnel. And, uh, if Rock Tunnel gets too frustrating, because I'm really bad at navigating through Rock Tunnel, if we spend way too long in the episode through Rock Tunnel, I'm just gonna have to cut at a specific point. Um, so yeah, so let's buy 20... Let's 
Five twenty-four balls. <laughs> yeah. So, um, I I'm very excited for the game because of what they've even announced right now. And you have to keep in mind that there's also more more mons, more regional evolution mons that are going to be coming into the game. And that just gets me so hyped up for the game. And speaking of hype for games, The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild sequel is coming out in like 2020. Not official release date, but it's expected to be coming out in 2020. Dude, I am so excited for that freaking game. Like that freaking game looks legit. Like that, that, well, they did give us like a teaser trailer. It didn't give us like an actual trailer yet, but you, you guys have no idea how excited for that game I am. Because I got into Zelda when Breath of the Wild came out. I got into Zelda, and I com I've completed Legend of Zelda, Breath of the Wild, Ocarina of Time. And I'm actually about to defeat Skyward Sword. I just haven't gone through the last, like, five boss fights that are at the end. But I haven't gone through it and beaten it yet. So, after that, there's actually, that actually brings me to my series. Uh, that's going to be involving games that I haven't played. I'm not going to explain what it is. But that series is going to be legit, and once I actually get it up and working, it's going to be amazing. Trust me. It's- I, I don't think anyone else- He's level 13. Is he going to have explosion? I'm actually worried he's going to have explosion. I feel like he is. Let's try it and see. Here's the thing, I don't want to keep Naruto in. But should I? Wait. So he's level 13. Do it. Okay. He's using rock throws. Well, let's just keep using rage a bit. Wait, what? Wait, what? Ability to disarm to that? I forgot. Wait. Oblivious. Wait, then what prevented? Wait. Is, does he have an ability that prevents using explosion? But while Reggie Rock's damp rock prevents wild Reggie Rock from using explosion. <laughs> what? That is insane. What is his luck though? I don't want to hit this man again. But if it comes to the point, all right. I gave you snap pokey puffs like it's gen six sec. He doesn't like Poké Puffs. He does not like Poké Puffs. Alright? This man doesn't like Poké Puffs. Uh, just please get on the wall. Uh, maybe he likes to squint. Oh, that's bullcrap. Richard Rock, you freaking suck, bro. If, like, you just, you're so freaking annoying, the fact that you just start exploding on everybody when everybody thinks you're annoying. Look, Mr. Rock, I'm not saying that you're annoying. I'm saying that your actions are very annoying. I'm just sort of saying that you're annoying, but I think you can work on it, man, all right? So exploding is very frustrating. We are so glad that you have that damp rock, or you would have died. Okay, so I see it's making you want to get out of the ball. I am probably annoying you. I want you to know that you will be an asset to this team. You will be a warrior against... E you freaking kidding me. Reggie Rock, I can annihilate you right now. How many times have you thrown a rock at us? How many times have you thrown a rock at us? Stop. Stop. Okay. That actually... Look. Okay. Okay. So, Reggie Rock. All right, man. You know, I didn't want to go here, but where are your eyes? Are your eyes those little, like, like seven, seven dots on your face? 
That's those aren't eyes. Those are little rocks glued on your face. All right, man. If you want me to shut up, just get in the freaking ball. Just get in the freaking ball. Do it. Oh, he he sees what I'm trying to do. He sees what I'm trying to do. All right. I guess I'm gonna have to sing some jingles. I'll give you milk and cookies like you're Santa Claus. I'll give you milk and cookies it's like you're Santa Claus. I'll give you milk. This man does not like milk and cookies, nor does he have, like Pokey Puffs. Now, does he like sweet tea though? I'll give you sweet tea, so come along with me. I'll give you sweet tea, so come along. He doesn't like eating nor drinking any. He's struggling now. That's scary. That's scary. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Get in the ball. I'll give you Pokey Puffs, like it's Jan 6. Dude! You are literally dying. Why are you doing this to yourself? Now that tells me that he only has... Rock throw. Oh, I should have inflicted status onto him or something. I should have inflicted status onto him. I think I have status too. Come on. Oh, wait, I need heal up. I think he's gonna die in this turn, though. Which makes me really frustrated. And he killed himself. You know, that's... That's bullcrap. Right there. That's... At least we, we can get experience, I guess? My gosh. Okay. So bear with me. I have no idea how... To, I don't know the sequence of getting through Rock Tunnel. Um, if this becomes too much of a pain, I'm just gonna have to skip this part of the video. Uh, me trying to get through Rock Tunnel. Because this is very... I, I never do know how to get through Rock Tunnel. Fresh water. That could be that could be a very good asset. Alright, let's fight this guy. And you are Bapu Beat dead. Alright. See you, bro. Oh, what? Oh, you have an extra mom? Oh, I accidentally used rage. Sorry, sorry. I meant to one-shot you. Alright. <laughs> I, I really want to get through uh, Rock Tunnel, but yeah, so, like I was saying earlier, Pokemon Sword and Shield looks so really, like, so cool. So, I, I know Pokemon games have always been on, like, portable devices, or they had been a while, um, but these are going to be really good graphic Pokemon games. Like, this is going to be really cool, and you're not going to, like, it, it doesn't look like, I don't think, will you be moving around with two Joy-Cons? That's my question. So, what, is it going to be somewhat like, like, let's go Pikachu and let's go Eevee? Or, so, here's the thing. You are, it's, it's not confirmed from that trailer that came out today. The fact that you are going to be using a PC system that resides in the Pokemon Center. You're not going to be carrying around a PC with you. Which is really, really frustrating. I'm not going to lie. I, I really like the aspect where you could just get your Mons if you needed them. Like, if you needed your mods, you can just be like, oh. Alright. Uh, you like, you you catch a really good mod. You catch, uh, I'm not gonna lie, the Duraton or catch a Zigzagoon, right? You're not gonna wanna have to go all the way back to the Pokemon Center to get that Zigzagoon. You're gonna wanna just have to pick it up right where you are. Like, I, I, I guess. I don't know. Um. Maybe they, maybe it's because people might change to good mods. I don't see their reasoning. I guess they just wanted to go back to traditional, like, having to go back to the Pokemon Center. But not gonna lie, I felt like it was a really good idea just to have, I have a lot of stuff that I can sell. You've got to be kidding me. But yeah, so you, like, I just like the fact that you could just pick Pokemon out of your box if you caught something like I don't want to I don't want to go back after going to wait what wait is this uh wake up um okay so I don't want to have to go all the way back to Pokemon Center to get a really good mod that I have or something like that's just inconvenient oh, I didn't I thought that they all held up damp rocks not gonna lie I guess we were just lucky. All right, let's go down. All right. Um, but yeah, so I really like that aspect. I'm sort of sad that they're taking that out of the game. But I think it's still going to be a really good game. Now, what makes me so mad about Pokemon Sword and Shield Traders when they come out, there's so many 
pretty sure there are a bunch of dislikes. I was about to go check, but I'm just like, no, it's fine. But I'm pretty sure there's so many dislikes because they don't have the ma national decks. I don't have, I'm not going to have time to go through the whole game and have a bunch of like 700, actually it's going to be like a thousand Pokemon now. I don't have the time to be going through and getting a thousand mons right now. I'm not, I don't have that kind of time. I don't think anybody really has that kind of time until unless they're like four. And not every four year old is going to be playing a Pokemon game. So, like, I feel like they should definitely. I'm glad that they're not adding the National Deck back. Sorry, I was thinking of my bed. Um, uh, I'm so glad that they don't that they don't have the National Deck because that gives the new Galar region Pokemon, which look amazing by the way. They're not just like the Alolan forms. Uh, but they're, at, like, they're actually really good. Now, the Alolan forms and the Alolan Pokemon were not bad. I'm not saying that they were bad or anything. I'm just saying the Galarian forms so far look a lot better. Or, Galarian forms and Galarian Pokemon look a lot better. Uh, that's just my personal opinion. Um, but yeah, so, that's just my personal opinion. You guys, obviously, can have your own opinions. If you guys think that this game might be a bust, that's you guys' opinion. I think that this is going to be a very good game. Shadow Tap? You've got to be kidding me, dude. Yeah, so I feel like it's going to be a very enjoyable game. And I'm going to have a lot of Pokemon to sort of just experience and stuff. Like, that's going to be really fun. Um. Oh, crap. Do a triple kick. There we go. Oh no, it cursed. It's it's cursing a lot, which is really making me I should not have been doing that. Rocky Oh, cause the fire spin. Come on, I'm just gonna have to land one. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um. But yeah, so I feel like it's going to be a very enjoyable game. Just coming right off that. But um, yeah, I think I'm going. To, it's going to be a very enjoyable game. And I'm really liking how the map looks. And I'm really liking how the legendaries are being a little set up right now. Like how they're they're being set up by Nintendo. I feel like it's really cool. I like it. I like what they're doing. Nintendo, you're doing a good job. What? Oh, yeah, this is trainer battle. I want to put Rocky up front before, like, I accidentally used all of his triple picks. Okay, yeah, just use Endure like a butthole. There you go. Eradicate. So, I am very excited for the game. Uh, type a one down in the chat if you guys are excited for that game. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I'm very excited for that game. Now, I've been occupying myself with, with, like, a lot of shows. I actually wanted to start watching My Hero Academia, and my mom was just like, you're watching way too many shows already. I was just like, I'm not watching that to me. <laughs> I, I had a realization there. I was just like, what? I, ha I, I have been watching a lot of shows. And it's because there are bu there's so many good shows, and it's because, like, I'm... I am starting one show, I'm watching it a bunch, but then I find another show, and then I watch that, and then during, while watching that show, I found another show, and I have a lot of shows in my play right now. So once I finish quite a few of those, I'm going to do, I'm going to watch uh, My Hero Academia, because that show looks amazing. I've heard that it's amazing. It's, it's, a lot, it's really good. Um, Alright, giraffe or you can... Yeah, okay, so I can tell that we're making progress, because... Yo, it's Zigzagoon, you were referencing today's... Oh yeah, so I really like, just quick side note, I really like how, um, really, you would think that the Galar form, Gather forms were, uh, uh, the secondary forms, like, they migrated over to Galar, but in reality, they actually, um... 
I'm sorry. They actually came from Gal Galar over to, um, uh, over to, um, where was the, uh, Hoenn. That's what I was trying to say. Okay, yeah. Okay. Sorry, I'm speeding up a lot right now. Um, so yeah, so, I, I felt like that was very interesting. That was very interesting to me. Hopefully we can get out of this cave, this cave soon. It, we're over to 30 minutes. I don't want to go too long. Okay, let's uh, run. Let's heal up. Alright, there we go. Yeah, so I'm very excited to play that game. And I think it's going to be a very wholesome game. Uh, back to Legend of Zelda. Um, I'm really hoping that it is a really good game. Um, now, what I'm very... I'm very uh, confused about is they're going to I, I think they're going to make a lot of changes to the overworld but I can't I'm trying to figure out so if they're going to make it changes to the overworld or not they probably they most likely are it's still not going to have as many like discoveries as the first time we did you know what I mean like the first time you go through Breath of the Wild it's just an open world where you can find remnants of the past games, but it's it's completely different. It's all in the wilds, and it's your choice where you go. I am very, very, like, I think they're still going to have a bunch of that, but they're going to have to make some, like, serious, some serious, um, uh, differ, differs in, uh, how, what? Oh my gosh, that's a water type. Why not switch in there? Like, and how, um, like they're gonna have to make some serious, uh, differences in the map to actually, like, so, to the map, to the enemies. Sorry, I just realized my face was over here. Yeah, so they're gonna have to make some very, very big changes to the map or to the enemies or something like that. Like, they're gonna have to make a lot of those. Okay, let's, uh, let's, uh, full heal that. So uh, give that a full heal. Yeah. How'd that feel? Hopefully felt good. Because that was my only full heal. Um, okay, let's just run. Yep. Yeah. Uh, I'm trying to uh, train this man up, but, you know, it's it's very hard. Alright. But, um, yeah, so I'm uh, I'm very excited for the game, but I'm really hoping that it's going to be a good game. If it's if it's a sequel to Breath of the Wild, it should be a good game. That's, that's what I'm saying. The sequel to Breath of the Wild should be an amazing game. Um, so yeah, so I'm very excited for a lot of future Nintendo games. Uh, I'm trying to keep the commentary up right now. But yeah, so, um, hope you guys have a great day today. I've said that for like the fifth time today. I'm sure that I've said, I'm pretty sure I said for the fifth time earlier, but whatever. So, I, um... I also, uh, the thing with the shows where I will... Um, where I will start a show and then get distracted by another one is the same thing I do with the Legend of Zelda series. Uh, like, I, I have a lot of <laughs> Zelda games right now. I just have only really defeated two. Who should I teach Sky Attack? I'm very confused, but uh, let's try Naruto because Naruto is gonna be a flying type at some point. So, no, no, no. Oh man, that was our catching bonds thing. It might be scary to use it in this tunnel. Okay, wait, what? Is that an HM? No. Okay. So yeah, um, I'm very excited for those games, and I. I'm trying to, I'm trying to think about, like, if I want to get the, um, okay, the, uh, The Link's Awakening remake. I'm trying to decide if I want to get that one. Because I'm thinking about, yeah, so it's a Zelda game, and it's a Zelda remake, and this is my chance to defeat another Zelda game. You know what I mean? Um, I'm really wondering, I think I'm going to want to. At some point. I think I'm going to want to, so I think when it comes out, I'm just going to buy it. 
And that's the same thing with Pokemon Sword and Shield. I don't want to wait until uh, Christmas to play it. I'm going to want... Because usually I'll wait until Christmas to buy Pokemon Sword and Shield. But um, I think this year I'm going to actually uh, just buy it myself. Because uh, I don't want to miss out on a lot of things in the game. Now at the same time, my brother's going to want to play it. So I don't know how that's going to work. But I'm going to at least buy my shield game. And my guy's going to have defense up, hope, up a bunch. And I am very excited for that. Because I'm not going to be that guy that gets destroyed by that one attack really quickly. I'm going to be that guy with the best defenses. Alright. Anyways. Um, I am very concerned about the length of this episode. Because I really don't want to be in here, be in here the whole time. But to, but to be fair, uh, Astro Mini videos took until the end of the freaking three-way series to actually... I was just missing against the Metapod. This man doesn't even move. You've got to be kidding me, man. There we go. Gosh. But, um, yeah. So, uh, I don't want to be in here too long. Uh, if you guys have not subscribed to Astro Mania Videos, Rigor 131, King Corefish, or United Gamer, you guys are doing yourself a disservice. They pretty much always bring a smile to my face whenever I watch them. Wait, didn't I already go through this? No. Nope. Cut. Uh, water. See, when I first caught Derp, I didn't think he was going to be a good asset to this team, but he really is a good asset to this team. Like, his color change ability might not be good move-wise, like, might not be good for his moves, but the fact of him getting hit by a super effective move and living, that is sweet. Because... Okay, bigger off. I would switch to Rocky, but Rocky... Doesn't have his move right now. He doesn't have a PP. And plus, actually, we have another one. Is he part fighting it? What the heck? Let's try this one more time. He's using uproar. Fury spikes. Okay. So yeah, um, very excited for those games. Need to complete some of those other games. Need to finish watching some shows. Oh, whoops. Um, yeah. Oh, and I have a lot, and a lot, so now. So I used to turn on my fan, and uh, obviously other stuff. Alexa just doesn't do that. Watch. Alexa, turn on my fan. Alexa, turn off the fan. I use it because at night I like having some type of noise in my ear with that light. So it's just like, oh, fan. And, um,. Uh, Alexis is very handy, and, uh, the fan, uh, also keeps my room cool. Because my room has the tallest ceiling, I believe, which means that it, it gets hotter in here than any other room. So, yeah. And this is actually one of the, the one room where I actually need it to be cold in here, because my PC... Has a really nice compartment, but I'm so afraid every time I put it in there. Because if I put it in there for too long, it gets really hot. So I normally, and I don't want it to overheat or anything. So I just try and keep it out. Keep the door open to the little compartment. And sometimes I like play with it, play with the door with my feet. Uh, if you guys hear it, I'm sorry. Uh, but yeah, so. Let's look over here. You're hearing a lot of jam. Jam, jam, jam. Are you kidding me? At least I know I'm going the right way since they're trainers. But it's still really annoying. Cuts. Cuts. Are you using belly drum? You've got to be kidding me, bro. Takedown isn't hurting anybody but yourself. Actually, it's really hurting me, but still. Still rough. Doing yourself a disservice, man. Okay, let's switch over to dirt. It's, uh... Water gun. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. That's... That's frightening. Outspeed? Thank you. 
Okay, my mons are very my mons are very low right now. And I understand I could pro 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 Oh my gosh. Yes! I probably could have gotten flash, but uh everything ended up being okay in the end. Alright, this is what we're going to do. I'm going to go ahead and heal up and we are going to get another encounter. Uh, and we will see what that is. So dun, 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 dun. Alright, uh, first of all, we need to sell some stuff. We need to sell the, um, what? So the Star Peaks. The Big Pearl. I'm getting a lot of, a lot of moolah for this, bro. Alright, how much does an HP up? Oh, that gives me a lot. Okay, I'm gonna do that. I'm doing that for no reason. Actually, for the fact that... You know, I have, the, I have these weird things that I do. Uh, sometimes it's because my nose itches. Sometimes I do that because... Um, I feel like there are air bubbles. Right between... My lip right there. And my mouth. I know it sounds very weird. But it's true. I'm gonna buy 15, and then the rest I'm gonna use on potions. Actually, so I'm gonna buy. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm gonna, the rest I'm gonna use on potions. Alright. Alright. Did I heal up? Yeah, I, heal, I healed up. That's the first thing I did. Okay, I need to stop. You just paid up. Rowdy. Alright. Let's check it. Okay, seriously, Gramps. I don't give a crap. I'm not going to pick up what you're selling. That's not the saying, but whatever. Okay. Change to a poison type. Well, I could have been using poison tail, but that still wouldn't have been very effective. Oh, meganium. That is. I can quad weak to that when I'm in there. Is this neutral now that I'm in? Not serious? I think it I am. Alright. Gamer Rich. No! You gotta be kidding me! Alright. More experience, but still. Yes. Actually, I'm using Mount Civi, so I'm not getting a lot of experience, I guess. Or I still am getting a lot of experience, but whatever. Alright, you're gonna survive. You're fine. Alright, bud. I've, I've come to, like, really like some of the songs, you know what I mean? Uh, like, some of the songs in Pikmin are, like, really good. They really are. Alright, I'm sorry I used to speed up a lot. I've just been, like, spoiled by speed up. Alright, let's see what we're gonna get. Because I feel like if I don't catch it, then I'm gonna regret it at some point or something. So that's the only thing. It doesn't have a lot, a lot of great moves. So let's try and catch it. Come on, get in the ball. Thanks, man. <laughs> Thanks, man. Um, let's call this man uh, Leafy. Why not? Leafy. He's very leafy. He has a giant leaf on his head. No. He has a lily pad. Uh, let's just call this man, uh, this girl, Lily, because she has a little bad on his head. It's pretty cool. Um, uh, pretty cool, man. Or girl. Alright, why do I keep messing that up? Um, yeah, so, let's do this. Alright, now, there are bikers over here that I really don't want to fight right now, at this moment. And there's a chemistry dude. Cut. Cuts. There we 
Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yes. Experience. Now, this is a fear. It's flying type, but we're fine. And I just really want steam through all, all steamroll through all this right now. Cause I really just wanna get to the freaking I just wanna get one more encounter. Cause look getting the low tad wasn't very hype and I'm set and I know I could also the next thing could also not be very hype. I'm just There we go. Okay, so route seven. Wait, is this the same route? No, this isn't the same route, right? Wait, is this? I don't have a town map for River 2. Let's just check through all where... Digos Cave... Digos Cave... Route 2... Route 25... Route 22... Route 9... Okay, there we go. It doesn't look like we have any problems. Alright! Now here's the thing about Tokate. It evolves with a Dawnstone, I believe. Or a Dawnstone or a Shiny Stone. One of those two, I believe. So it evolves through that. It could still be power, though. It could definitely still be power. I'm gonna tackle it. Oh, I'm paralyzed. Of course I'm paralyzed. Oh, hit it again. Metronome. That is scary as frick. Is that all it has? Wait, wait, wait. Do I have any Pokemon with status? Do I have any models with status? Hopefully the layout's actually okay right now. Yes, yes. A Hedwig has, um... Hedwig has Hypnosis for. What's this? What? Oh, I'm trapped into Sand Tomb. Uh, let's just go ahead and heal up to pass the time, you know what I mean? Just... You know, just give a self-reflection on life. You know what I mean? Uh, I was hurt by Sam to Sam to Um, no, I'm not gonna attack. Let me start throwing some balls. How about that? What? I think I was free from. I might have been free from. Yeah, I was free from Sam. All right. Um, let's check. I haven't looked at the recording. I'm really hoping that the, that the recording's okay. Uh, hidden power. Alright. Let's, um, let's hypnosis. Now, okay. I was cured from sleep for some reason. Why was it cured from sleep? Oh, come on. Please stop. Please stop. It's fast asleep. Okay. Alright, then let's set up a reflex. Let's throw some balls. Let's throw a great ball. Yes! Alright, uh, what do we name this thing? Um. How about a Toga Tick? More like Toga. Toga. And token, to token. <laughs> All right, let's just do it. <laughs> just do it, token. I I'm not gonna call it token because that, that. Oh my gosh, that means that it's a it's something that is to be traded out for another mon, like in an egg block. I mean, I really wish I could do one of those. Token. All right. Sort. It's Tegan. I just named my freaking Pokemon Tegan. Uh, I don't think there's anything to actually be done in that. Uh, Cerulean City. Um, I'm so glad I haven't had cut or anything. So this episode should not be that hard to edit. Actually, I want that, that thing put on my team. Uh, I know that we've been going for about 50 minutes right now, and I said we were going to go for about 45. Yeah, that's not shiny. That's just a sprite. Okay. Let's check out these mods. Let's check out Tegan first. Or Tegan. Whatever. Quiet nature. Shedskin ability. Heals the body by shedding. 
I'm gonna actually look that up in a little bit on what that actually is. The Metrodome, Sweet Kiss, Yawn, and Encore. So it does have a good bit of status, but doesn't Sweet Kiss put them to sleep anyway? Wait. Foe with the sweet cuteness that causes confusion. Oh, uh, that causes confusion. The reason I went back up to Metrodome down to Yawn is to make sure that I thought for a second that it said the same thing. As the description. No, I didn't want to move him. I wanted to look at his summary. To see if I actually wanted to... Um... I don't know party. Okay. Modest nature. Alright, Lily. Uh, shed... What the frick? Okay, what is with so many mons having shed skin? What is with this? Oh my gosh. What is with these wands having shed skin? What the heck? Like, this has shed skin and the other one has shed skin. What is with that? Oh my gosh. Astonish, growl, absorb, nature power. I feel like there's like a heck of a game or something. And let's look at gully pool. Bold nature, suction cups. Okay. Okay. Um, I think we're going to add Tegan or Tegan to our party and replace Tegan with uh, Whirlpool. Alright. Uh, but anyways, as always, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please leave a like, comment down below. Subscribe if you liked this video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Bye.